Hello everyone, hope you're having a fantastic day. This morning we got quite a treat in store for y'all. We're heading over to the Peckaway Cafe inside of SC Real Foods on this episode of Touring Our Local Market here in Florence, South Carolina. This place has the best breakfast option that you can get in town, especially when compared to the fast food options when you're on the way to work in the morning. They have a full smoothie bar. Their lunch menu is fantastic. They have an online ordering system for convenience and they have a reward system that as you can see, we take full advantage of. This place is a local favorite. It's a family preference and it may just be a hidden gem for some of y'all. So we're gonna go over there. We're gonna meet Valerie Criswell, the operator of Peckaway Cafe and see what they have to offer. SC Real Foods is located on the corner of Palmetto and Celebration Boulevard. And I'm telling you that they have the best chopped cheese that you can get in the county of Florence. And so with that being said, let's go check them out right now. I'm Val Criswell with SC Real Foods, and I'm so excited to have this opportunity. Thank you, Sammy, for, um, for yeah. letting me let people know what's going on here. So why don't you tell us a little bit about the background of the restaurant, and I know you're big on your mission statement. Yes. Tell us what you guys are about. We are not like <laughs> any other kind of restaurant because we have a reason for being here. Um, years ago, I was diagnosed with an illness. The doctors told me that I would be on medication the rest of my life, but the Lord told me otherwise. And so when I switched from um, eating commercial food to eating wholesome, real food, it made all the difference in my health and the Lord healed me through that process. God made food to make us healthy and to nourish us. And if our food is making us sick, there's a problem with our food. And so that's what we try to do at SC Real Foods is we try to make more wholesome food more accessible to people. So we do breakfast service, and that is from 8 to 11, and then we also, that's Monday through Friday, not Saturday. We also do our lunch service through Peckaway Cafe from 11 to 3 p.m. Monday through Friday. Peckaway Cafe is closed on Saturday, but all of SC Real Food Services, as far as the Real and Ready service, as well as Smoothie Bar, is open every day that we're open from 8 a.m. till 6 p.m. Our premier breakfast sandwich is called the Foghorn Leghorn, and that is a buttermilk fried chicken with bacon, egg, and cheddar, and we put that on a grilled English muffin. Additionally, you can um, choose a breakfast bowl. We've got our crispy potatoes, but you can also instead choose our non-GMO stone ground grits that come from Edisto Island. We're excited about those. Currently for breakfast also, we are using our Light Farms eggs, which are all organically raised, and those are local. Additionally, we have taken on the task of making homemade grape jelly that is completely organic, and it will blow your socks off. It is so full of flavor instead of sweetness, and really that's what we want it to be about, right? We don't just want to put sugar in our mouth. We want to have something that tastes really great. Our breakfast sausage is a three ounce patty. It is from heirloom pasture raised pork from Colfax Creek in Bostick, North Carolina. We're proud of that too. You can't beat that. I defy you to go around here and beat that. We make all of our soup in-house, homemade with organic stock. All vegetables, we don't use any um, of that weird ingredients, no preservatives, and that's why it's so amazing, and that's why people come in all the time to get our hot homemade soup. It's ready all the time. If SC Real Foods is open, you can get hot homemade soup. We have been told that we have the best Reuben sandwich that people have eaten, even from New York. We're very proud of it. Okay, yeah, I know that's <laughs> a big claim. Come by and try it, and you let me know.
we go out of our way and we go to the extra expense on your behalf to use all grass-fed beef in all of our um, dishes that have ground beef in them. All right, so Miles, what are you making? This is our Miles' chopped cheese sandwich. Uh, six ounces of ground beef. So for the people that don't know, what's a chopped cheese? Chopped cheese is a New York sandwich, a, a sandwich that's special to New York. But um, I wanted to bring our own version here. You know. So what's on the chopped cheese? It's uh, six, six ounces of ground beef, sauteed onions, lettuce, tomatoes, and pickles with our Thousand Island dressing, homemade Thousand Island. Nice. On this hoagie roll. Season it a little bit more. Once it's well done, I put four slices of cheese on it. So I had to take a seat after all that food. Listen, I don't think there is a better breakfast in town. All right, now I'm not selling, I'm telling. Those grits are probably the best you can get in Florence right now, especially if you like creamy grits. The eggs are fresh, that makes a difference. That grape jelly is ridiculous. It is not overhyped. It was super fresh, it's power packed flavor, but it's still fresh and crisp and light at the same time. And then they've got a really diverse and quick menu for when you're on your lunch break. But out of the options that we tried, I'm not a big chicken salad guy, but it was light, it was fresh, it was really good. Uh, the chicken tenders are fresh and they are really good, but that Reuben, and I know I'm going to get slammed by the New Yorkers and the folks from New Jersey on here, but I'm telling you that this is Florence, South Carolina. This isn't the Northeast. That Reuben sandwich was really good. That's the first time I've had it, and God willing, it will not be the last. And then likewise, the star of the show, and shout out to my man Miles. I've known Miles for a long time. Uh, he created and brought that chopped cheese sandwich to the menu and it is really good. This is Florence, South Carolina. If you're looking for a chopped cheese, then you need to come over to Peckaway Cafe at SC Real Foods and check them out. If you didn't know about these guys, because I know it could be a hidden gem to some of y'all, there was a point in time where I didn't realize how good the food was here. You need to come check them out. And so a special thanks again to Miles, a special thanks to Val for having us and hosting us. We really appreciate y'all. And if y'all appreciate these videos and enjoy this content, 
like the video, subscribe to the channel, share the videos, and we really appreciate y'all and we look forward to seeing y'all on the next one. Wow, that's really good.